Ninja Johnny got a head of fiery hair and a turbocharged backpack. The genius sisters use him like a lab rat. A neat freak dad at home, a super busy mom. But the boy's best friend is a talking dog. Three stream jeans in an air breathing shark. Mega action game controller skating in the park. A feral booster bling bling. What do we make of this? Johnny Test. Johnny Test. This is a life of a boy named Johnny Test. Johnny climbs to the top of the turnbuckle, and he drops the boom on the Dog of Doom. My name is Doom Dog, not the Dog of Doom. <laughs> oh no, I smell cleaning day. It's cleaning day! Dad, listen, I'm really looking forward to cleaning day and... Huh? <laughs> you do that? The power of cleaning, son. And now it's your turn to use the power on the entire downstairs. <laughs> downstairs? But I'll be so bored. No, because I'm going to let you in on a family secret. The cleaning song. The cleaning song? Dad, whatever crazy song you whipped up in your head, it will not help me clean. With a swish swish here and a scrub scrub there, it's time to clean up everywhere. So say goodbye to filth and grime. I'll clean this mess in double time. Well, it used to be a chore, but it isn't anymore. When you got the secret to a super clean floor, now the dirt's all gone and it didn't take long. When you sing along to the clean up song, when you sing along to the clean up song. Great job, son. And now that the house is clean, I'm gonna prepare a cleaning day feast. <laughs> well, say all you want, but you gotta admit, the song was catchy. And now it's stuck, stuck, stuck in my head, head, head. <laughs> okay, calm down, down, down. It'll wear off. And it's my dog I grab and I take to the lab. Oh, help me! Johnny, it's cleaning day, and we promised Dad that we'd clean and not experiment if he promised not to sing us some clean-up song. Ah! He sang the song to Johnny? It's bad, but catchy. Dad will never, never know if you make the song go. Away from my brain, I'm going insane. <laughs> okay, 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 we'll help. But only because we love you. And it gives us a chance to test our bad memory eradicator, which locates all bad memories in the brain and zaps them out of your head. We hope. <laughs> What if the machine erases too much of his memory? Oh, calm down, Manic Mud. It's not like he's gonna drool or forget how to eat or anything. With a switch, switch, cheer, and it's, it's the switch, it's the switch! <laughs> Johnny, the cleaning song. Can you sing it? Ow! Ah, ah. You erased his brain? There was a malfunction, yes. <gasps> Don't panic. I backed everything up onto a hard disk. All I have to do is reload Johnny's memories back onto his brain drive and... Why does it say not enough memory? How can there not be enough memory? It's his brain! Because we accidentally backed up Johnny's brain on the same drive as all our new photos. I'll delete them so we can restore drooling and falling Johnny's memory. Dad! Wow, the lab looks so clean, which means it's going to be the best cleaning day feast ever. Mm -hmm. Dinner's in one hour. And make sure you and Johnny are there and that you haven't done any experiments that would upset me. Sure thing, Dad. Ah! Yeah. Restore Johnny's brain now. But he 
Gil's memories are mixed up with every picture we've ever taken of Gil. They're all on the same drive. From the first picture we ever took of Gil cleaning his pool to the last photo we took of him cleaning his pool. <sighs> You're saying your pictures of Pretty Boy are more important than Johnny's memories? We're saying we just have to buy some time to delete the not-so-important pictures so we can reload Johnny's memories. Well, what are you gonna do? Train Johnny how to behave at the dinner table so your dad won't notice you erased his brain? And dinner is in one hour! I was joking. They are... Now, Johnny, this is a napkin. And when you eat, you... <laughs> <laughs> Just erase the gill pictures. Never! Besides, he's a quick learner. Johnny, see how I put water in my mouth? Now you try. <laughs> no, technically he's right. <laughs> Every one of these photos is gillicious. Ah, uh, blurry gill. Wait! I'll just delete some of the Johnny memories like I should have in the first place. But what are the bad memories? That's it, little Johnny. Go boom boom. Mm. Boom boom. Potty training. Yeah, I should leave this one. <laughs> Darn it! Now, during dinner, the neighbor's cat will appear in the window and meow for a morsel. And that's when you always say, Kitty! Kitty! This is never gonna work. No, Dookie's a dog. Kitty will appear in the window. Kitty! No, Johnny, that's a garbage truck. Kitties are fluffy and evil and... Where's Johnny? Johnny? Kitty! Kitty! You had to erase his brain. We were trying to help! Now run, dog, run! Great. Now that I've separated Johnny's good memories from bad, I can just delete the bad ones. This won't hurt a bit. Hmm. This won't hurt a bit. Okay, we're not all his bad memories. Are we? This won't hurt a... Okay, perhaps we are. And if I erase them, then there'll be plenty of room for the new memories. Darn it, again! <laughs> He's gotta be here somewhere. Danger everywhere, but no kitty! Kitty! Wow, he's really having a hard time with kitty. But he's safe and sound. He's not safe or sound! Kitty! That's not a kitty! Kitty? Dad is gonna be really mad if we bring a squished Johnny to dinner! <laughs>
is still too big for his brain. Just delete a file, any file. We'll train him later. Backing up now. Which means it's cleaning day festival feast time! Now let's all dig in and enjoy a nice dinner as a family! You erased Johnny's brain, didn't you? Not all of it. <laughs> Kitty! <laughs> See? Girls! We can explain! Kitty! Please let me babysit him. His name is Clyde. I've always wanted to be a monkey sitter. Orangutan sitter. He is not a monkey. Whatever. I'll be great. Aren't I great at everything? Most people would say yes. Please! Last time we let you keep an eye on something, we never saw our whoosh ray again. Okay, me next, me next. Refreshing and undressing at the same time? We are never giving this wish ray back. I see Ingrid, I see Prince, I see Johnny's underpants. <laughs> Oops, my finger slipped. Yeah, I don't know what happened to that wish ray, but must have just, you know, I mean. Right. We don't have a choice. We're going to have to leave him with Johnny. We have to go to the Institute to present our observations on orangutans. And Professor Slopsink will be here today at 5 p.m. to see Clyde for himself. So until then, keep him out of trouble. Don't forget that. 5 o'clock. Oh, yeah, and whatever you do, do not let Clyde watch TV. And now, back to Booger Battle. <laughs> Should I ask? Oh, yeah. <laughs> His name is Clyde. <laughs> and I'm babysitting him. Looks like you're watching TV. Well, just like all good babysitters, we're becoming friends through the power of watching television. Works for me. We've been in cheese it before a knickerbockers flop the twist, see? Uh, should you be letting Clyde watch this? Yep. <laughs> Wow, he really likes this show. Bank robbers, car chases, bags with dollar signs on them. Who wouldn't? Clyde isn't watching TV the best. <laughs> monkey friend watching TV. Monkey friend hanging out with me. Technically, he's an orangutan. Whatever. We interrupt this program for an urgent news bulletin. This morning, Pork Belly's only chimney sweep officially left town too. I'm sorry. To join an all chimney sweep singing and dancing troupe. This is breaking news. Arr, dancing on the rooftops, we give each other mad drops. Sweep, 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 sweep! So dirty. How will Santa Claus bring us presents? Hey, where'd our monkey buddy go? Orangutan. And why is the front door smashed through in the shape of Clyde? Dookie, we have a problem. I hate to break it to you, pal, but you're not winning any awards for best orangutan sitter. <laughs> Dookie, is today National Howl Like a Monkey Day? As a matter of fact, it's not. Then that must be Clyde! Come on! <laughs> Clyde, we gotta get you home before the girls show up with that science dude. Here, at least put this on. <laughs> oh, I get it. He wants to open a low-yield savings account to plan for his future. How responsible. <laughs> Susan and Mary's whoosh ray. Did you take that from my secret hiding spot under my bed? I, I mean, from the girls' lab? <laughs> There's a huge monkey robbing the bank! Oh, I was wrong. He wanted to rob a bank like in those gangster movies we watched. Rob a 
Okay, it's like in those gangster movies we watched. Hey, you think you'll split the money with us? We're not splitting anything. Clyde's going to jail. Yeah, Susan and Mary won't be cool with that. <laughs> Officer, you're just in time. Uh, we're not with him. Nope. <laughs> Don't even know the guy. You're all under arrest. This is all a misunderstanding. <laughs> Clyde, you are a bad monkey. A rank attack. Whatever. In pursuit of bank robbers, suspects are two hairy males and a flame-headed boy. You are the worst orang attack center ever! Either we're really fast, or that car is really slow! I never should have let him watch TV. Susan and Mary are gonna kill me. Dookie, what do we do? We have to turn him in. You're his accomplice now. Me? We're in this together, buddy. Yeah, the thing is, I'm just an innocent dog. <laughs> Woof. Oh, what are we gonna do? <laughs> Would you look at that? He's grooming you. How hygienic. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you, Clyde. Unless someone just gives us a getaway car, we're gonna spend the next 100 years in prison. <laughs> Is this the Palace Hotel? Park it somewhere shady, Valet. No, I am not driving a getaway car. I knew you shouldn't have let Clyde watch TV. Hey, monkey friend, looking sharp. That's orangutan, friend. Mm -hmm. Isn't that the old guy's suit? Should I drive us to jail just to get this over with? I know this looks bad, but I got a plan. You do? Well, no. Sarge, I'm naked. Can I go home? Clyde, as your babysitter, I should tell you, no naked blasting the police. Johnny, we have to turn him over to the police. Clyde is my monkey friend, and friends don't let friends go to prison. <laughs> Besides, the girls will kill me if he's not home by five. Now drive, dog! I think he has to use the bathroom. Okay, pull over. He can use the bathroom up there at that bank. Now, Clyde, promise you won't rob it. I'm serious. Promise most sacred monkey promise. Swear on a million bananas. Well, I guess if he swears on a million bananas... <laughs> Hypothesis. Your research with Clyde is very intriguing. Conclusion, if everything goes smoothly, you could be looking at ten Nobel Prizes. Yes. Ah! What is that? Ah! Alternate conclusion. If something went wrong, you'd never touch a lab in this town again. to stop at the mall for ice cream. Hey, Clyde and I deserve a last meal before we get carted away forever. <laughs> All right, come on, put your hands up! There's no way out of this, Johnny. Clyde's running around with stolen money. A crime's a crime. Don't do the crime if you can't do the time. Where'd you get that from, a book of crime sayings or something? Uh, it, no. Hey, where'd Clyde go now? Oh, there he is. Oh, no. If he imitates more bad TV shows, there's no telling what he'll do. Clyde! Where'd he go? He was right here. Clyde! 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 <laughs> ah! <laughs> Unnecessary rumpus! We have to shut down the TVs or he's gonna keep changing. Hey, he's not so bad. <laughs> Susan and Mary want us to bring Clyde home now. I had one job, and I blew it. If only we could do it all over again and not let Clyde watch that stupid gangster movie. Too bad we can't rewind real life. Yeah, too bad you can't... Aha! Donkey, you're a genius! I am. <laughs> Stop imitating what you see on TV! Okay, seriously! We're coming in right now! We mean it! Johnny! Gotcha! Hey, Clyde, look at this! 
we better chase it before a nickel pocket. Now look at this. <laughs> What's Clyde doing now? If watching a movie forward made him rob a bank, maybe watching it backwards will make him unrob it? This better work! I like that shirt. <laughs> That monkey returned all the money it yeah! All right, boys. I guess we can go home. Johnny! I can't believe you let Clyde watch TV! Yeah, I'm sorry. I should have listened and been a better monkey sitter. No! You proved our theory. Monkey see, monkey do. Don't you mean orangutan see, orangutan do? Correct! 100 Nobel Prizes for everyone! Clyde unrobbed the bank, we were involved in a high-speed backwards chase, and my sisters are mad at me. Everything did work out great. Not everything. Porkbelly still lost its best chimney sweep. Wait, wasn't that a movie? Yep, I got it right here. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> now Santa Claus can come down the chimney again. Thank you, chimney sweep. He is enthusiastic. 